New at noon, Halloween is finally, finally here, and as children search for the best pieces of candy, parents need to be on high alert. And joining us now is Captain Brian Turner with the Mississippi Bureau of Narcotics. How are you doing, Captain? Good, good. So what message do you want to give parents, especially when they go out trick-or-treating tonight and get that candy? Parents want to make sure that the packages are completely sealed. Um, one thing is look for emblems, uh, THC emblems on the packaging. Uh, most of your THC products will have that listed on the packaging. Look for things like marijuana emblems. Uh, if it doesn't look safe, throw it away. Uh, if they're concerned about it, uh, don't let the kids have it. Uh, these packages are, are very similar to the regular package that you buy at your store, so they're colorful. Uh, they look like basically um, what other, other kids would want or what you could buy at the store, but they have something in them a little extra that your normal candies don't. Right now we are actually showing some of the images that you sent to me. This looks like your typical candy, but the, these candies are laced with marijuana, THC, Correct. and what else? Correct. THC is mainly what they're laced with. And they're so similar to what you can get at any grocery store, any corner store. But like, they, like I said, they do have that THC, which could be very harmful to a kid uh, if they ingest it. Uh, the THC content may not be extremely high, but it could still be harmful to that kid. And um, have you all come across anything like this before where, you know, kids mistakenly get thinking they're actually having a candy or having chips and come to find out it's not? Unfortunately, we have. We've had kids get something, get a hold of something that's their parents and take it and have been rushed to the hospital. Uh, like I said, it, it, it's, it's not meant for smaller kids. Uh, some of medical items been taken by kids that didn't need to take it. And uh, with the similarity in the packaging and how similar it looks to just what you get, like I said, at your grocery store, kids don't really read the ingredients. They just see Skittles, they see uh, M&Ms, and they assume it's, it's for them. And uh, if it's not in a proper space uh, and they get a hold to it, it could, it could really harm them. Oh, okay. So now we do have some tips, if we can just bring this up real quick, as to what parents need to do, if you can just go over this for us. Right. Any packages that parents get, they definitely want to check it. Look for resealing, and that just looks like it, the package has been glued again. Uh, don't take candy from anyone you don't know. Uh, also, any doubts, throw it away. Uh, go in groups, uh, let the parents check it when they get back, and if they have something that's real questionable, uh, they can also call their law enforcement for the property destroyed. Okay. Anything else you want to let us know, Brian, before we let you go? I'm enjoying this cool weather. <laughs> <laughs> You're probably Definitely. the only yeah. one right yeah. now. Yeah, I'm, I'm loving it. Uh, I hope everyone has a safe Halloween. Uh, use caution. Uh, travel in groups. Mm -hmm. And uh, let the parents check that candy. All right. Thank you so much there, Captain. Thank you. Competition. <laughs>